What is going on, Gaming Nation? My name is Mr. Studley, and this is an episode of the Forest Survival Guide. <laughs> so, this episode, I'm going to be going through something really simple. Something that maybe a lot of you already know. But it's something that I, know, I, I, I think first-time players just won't do. It's something that, uh, if you don't do, may cause you to stop playing the game or have a fit of rage. And I'm talking about blocking. <laughs> People, um, for those of you who did not know, you can block in the forest. And I know there's still gonna be a couple of you who are going, Ooh, well that was fucking obvious. Look, when I first played this, there's two times I actually played this. And... Okay, well basically, when I played this, there's two times I played this, I didn't block. I, I didn't even think to block. This game doesn't tell you anything. You walk into the world, and you do what you do. The game tells you nothing. You just you just try to survive. You, you figure out the controls yourself and whatever. What I did when I started this game, when I ran into the cannibals, all I did was try to hit them. I didn't even think to press the right mouse button. All I did was try maybe time it, wait for them to rush at me, and then start wailing at them like a lunatic. And I'm not the only one. I watched uh, PewDiePie's video, his first video. I don't know if he's going to make a second one. And I watched uh, this one random guy's video. Both of them did what I did. And it came to reason in my head. I was like, yeah, I don't think too many people are going to do this because the game doesn't tell you you can block. And I think we're used to games telling us we can do this extra stuff. It should be common... I can't even say it should be common sense. It, I guess it should be logical that the game would have a uh, um, parrying system, but it doesn't tell you. <laughs> so, it's, it's going to be another short video. Um, I'm going to... What you should be see, what you're seeing in front of you is um, just examples of me blocking and playing waste to cannibals like I thought this game was difficult as shit I think a lot of a lot of other people did too because I, I, I saw other people's videos and I, I saw comments as well saying this is one of the hardest games I have ever bloody played oh my god because it's also scary I saw comments like that and I agreed with that I was like this game is not only it was scary honestly it's not really scary anymore but I mean I'll be like in, in response to that comment, like, this game, yeah, it's it's scary, and it's super hard. That's a bit, <laughs> of, a, a bit of a messed up combination there. So, the game isn't that hard. I, like, after I learned how to block, dude, I could go anywhere I wanted. Nothing can kill you if you block. Enough said. So... I, I think I've wasted enough of your time. Uh, yeah, you got the gist of it as soon as you clicked on the video. Uh, well, I mean, as soon as the intro finished. You got, you got the gist of it. You can block, and if you do it well, you don't even have to do it well. If you're blocking and they hit you from behind, no damage. You just need to be able to know that when they're about to hit you, I block them. They're not hitting me to hit them back. And I mean, right now, the AI is a little glitchy, even though they do do their cool... I'm gonna try surround him tactics. They do often stand still. Except for the guy you're focused on. He usually doesn't stand still. But, uh, yeah. Forest made easy. Start blocking. Start blocking people. <laughs> My name is. I've been Mr. Studley. And I'll see you guys.